Well, hi. My name is Metro. You may know me, but you likely don't know what you're looking at right now. I'll tell you. This is the Game of Thrones mod for a game called Crusader Kings 2. Now, the function of this video is pretty much strictly informative. And in, unfortunately, you know, informative to people who don't already know of this. If you do already know of this, and you're not aware that there's been an expansion to it, uh, you now know that as well. Look at that. It's like I'm a dictionary. I'm fucking handing out facts. It's unreal. This has just been released today. Uh, well, now yesterday, but Tuesday, uh, the 17th of December, 2013. And basically, they have added Essos, the entire continent, uh, with a, a lot of, I mean, literally triple, in my opinion, like triple the features. Uh, they've added a bunch of new stuff. We're going to look at that quickly. But um, it, it, in terms of what you're what you're looking at here, uh, this is a, a grand strategy game, I believe the game, uh, the original game would be developed as. Grand strategy game. Basically, you control, you can pick literally anyone ever to play as. Uh, the, the original game set in like Middle Ages, right before the Crusades, and then right after the Crusades, depending on how you pick it. I'll leave that up to you guys, but to, to figure out if you know you're interested in that kind of game. But what you're playing here is a free mod. Uh, if you're into Game of Thrones, the Game of Thrones universe, this is a mod that is going to allow you, using the original concept of the game, to essentially play as anyone, uh, any like a lord, a king. You could play as Joffrey. You could play as you know Tywin Lannister. You could play as anybody. Literally any landed human being in this fucking series uh, and now that the essos mod is out you can now play with everybody on that side of the place uh, I, I guess uh any of the free cities since they are labeled as republics require the republic dlc which really sucks uh, i don't have that dlc and i don't think i'm going to spend money on it i was kind of actually looking forward to playing as maybe pentos or volantis but uh, that, that's not an option for me. What is an option, though, which is pretty much, in my opinion, the best option uh, for the Essos continent, is you can play as Daenerys. All right, so I'm going to tell you a little bit about that. Uh, Daenerys has obviously nothing in the shows, you know, the series, the way the game is currently, or the way the, the books and stuff are currently. She pretty much does not have anything. I'm not going to spoil it for you, which I maybe have done already. But long story short, she's going to come to power based on which... Uh, historical time period you play there's only two that really involve her it's gonna be the clash of kings one or the uh feast for crows one now both of those books and so stories are out already so many of you probably already know what happens but long story short uh, she she comes to power let's put it that way for the sake of spoilers and in my opinion is really the only option uh if you're gonna play essos you might as well play as her because she can pretty much do whatever the fuck she wants. And this is the true... Like, when I play Crusader Kings 2, the original game, the vanilla game, I play it for a reason. I want to pick a small area and just completely dominate everything. Like, take over all of Europe, all of, like, Jerusalem and the Holy Land. Just go nuts, right? And this is why you pick Daenerys. Because it's literally the exact same thing. She starts with nothing. And through a series of fortunate events... She finds herself in the favor of many, many troops, okay, and at the command of what possibly could be the biggest empire ever, if you build it that way. So my original plan is to take where she starts, once again, spoiler free, and pretty much just take over the fucking world. And, you know, using the Crusader Kings model, I'm able to do that, which is really, really, really cool. So everything you see on the screen right now, I could literally take over, and I can create the kingdoms as I go. I could usurp titles, so I could literally declare myself King of the Iron Throne, and then if I fight a war and win it, I will now be Daenerys of the Iron Throne. You know what I mean? I could marry, in fact, I think I actually married the Prince of Dorne, uh, just for the sake of this, you know. But um, this is it. I just wanted to tell you guys about this. It's really, really, really cool. If you have any interest in Game of Thrones, uh, the game itself is pretty cheap, and the mod is free, obviously, so uh, here is... Obviously, you probably can't see this very well, but either way, this is, you know, the um, the info of these two pages here. One's a thread, one's a Reddit, and one's like a post. But uh, some, some of the new features, they've included slavery, uh, piracy. These are new, completely new to both uh, Crusader Kings 2 and the mod. 
added just recently. And it's not necessarily finished. They're claiming that, which is fine, I guess, obviously. But uh, this is, like I said, this is literally three times larger than the previous game. And now, uh, I didn't really like the Game of Thrones model a lot be before this. But now that there's so much to do, like, in the world. That, that was the biggest complaint I had. That, like, you know, you're going to play as the Reach. Well, that's nice. That's literally half a fucking Westeros, isn't it? So, what am I going to do from there? Like, take over the Westerlands? Like, that's not as fun. But this... I definitely, definitely, definitely am going to be probably playing as, um, I can't decide who I'm going to play as on Westeros, but I am going to be taking over Essos. I'm going to do what everybody could not. I'm going to launch an invasion, a full-scale invasion. And then I'll probably do the opposite. I'll probably play as Daenerys, take over all of Essos as well, and then maybe take over Westeros. We'll see. But me and Meoni have actually been considering playing it. Might do a small Let's Play. If you guys have any interest in that, let us know. Otherwise, any questions, happy to answer them. Uh, there's obviously a lot to talk about about this game, and I don't want to make this a 20-minute video. So just for the purpose of it, just wanted to say I am Metro. This is now out. Uh, it's 100% free once you own the game. So to be honest, if, if a bunch of people, you know, if, if actual people wanted to play it, uh, you could host a multiplayer server, which is what me and Mione were doing last night, checking out the possibilities and you know we could really do some damage like i was considering playing as you know maybe the iron throne pretty cliche but i'd play as the iron throne and he would play as daenerys and we would literally combine our forces to just take everything like we would i would even maybe even marry her like as tommen i guess or you know whoever oh wow that's a spoiler um, the king whoever the king is at the time right depending on what what situation we're in and i would marry her maybe if it's possible, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but that's the that's the beauty of the game. So, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask them. Otherwise, now you know. <laughs>